Um, hey guys, this is Chris Parsons here and I'm going to be doing um, a 10 minute circuit workout that works the core. Um, it's going to be 5 minutes warming up with a kettlebell, uh, about 8 kilograms, and I'm going to do um, uh, eight, 8 reps of uh, uh, goblet squats with a 20 kilogram kettlebell, followed by uh, a clean and press, eight, 8 reps of those, and then after a 20 second rest do 10 chin ups uh, using the pull up mate behind me, and then using my bench I'm going to do one arm bench press. Um, and at the end of the circuit, I'm going to finish off with five sets of five uh, chest sets, uh, bench presses. So I hope you enjoy the workout and um, uh, just uh, follow along. Okay. rest there, I've uh, got another uh, two minutes to go. Um, incidentally, I've got uh, two elbow pads on which protect your elbows from tennis elbow and other injuries. Um, plus I've got some uh, uh, gloves which protect your uh, hands from calluses, uh, particularly on the kettlebells and chin ups, so they can uh, they get quite badly calloused if you don't wear gloves, so that's quite a good idea too. Okay, we'll carry on with the warm up and then we'll begin with the first set.
have another 40 seconds to go. Okay, we're nicely warmed up now, so we'll uh, begin the um, first circuit, which is uh, again four exercises, a mix of uh, eight sets of eight reps of um, uh, 20 kilogram goblet squats, followed by 20 second rest, and then uh, eight, eight reps of um, clean and press with a uh, eight kilogram dumbbell uh, kettlebell, and then followed by 10 chin ups, 20 second rest, and then finish off with a single arm bench press. There you go. the end of the first three circuits take a minute's rest here and then do another uh, second the second set next <laughs>
that's the end of the second circuit. One more circuit to go with uh, one minute rest, uh, followed by five sets of five of the bench press. Already, I'm working up a pretty bad sweat, feeling the burn. Uh, chin up is pretty challenging next to the end of the circuit, so uh, you won't need to train long uh, to get a good calorie burn and a good uh, burn on those muscles and uh, achieve hypertrophy on the arms and the back and the, and the core. But all these exercises are designed to target the core uh, by working multiple muscle groups um, at the same time, maximizing your gains and your, uh, your toning. Um, well, there's no such thing as toning, but if you want to uh, really try and burn some fat and build those muscles, this is, this is a really good way of doing it in a short amount of time. So I hope you enjoyed the video uh, and uh, <laughs> maybe getting as tired as I am already. Okay, one more circuit then, keep it going. I know you can do it. Uh, just a bit more effort when I get to the end. Okay, right. Five more seconds and then we'll get going. Okay, you should aim for a 20 second rest between these exercises. I'm going to give myself another 20, I'm getting a bit tired. Uh, but uh, nearly there.
Okay, that's three sets of ten all together. Just the uh, bench press to go now. There you have it, there's the circuit. Uh, so we take about a minute or two's break here and then uh, we finish off with uh, five heavy, five reps of um, bench presses. Uh, I'm using um, Body Max selector belts. Uh, you can pick the pair up for about 300 pounds online. Very good, very easy to use. Easy to change or change down the weight. Uh, the weight. Um, as you can see the pull up made behind me, so it's about 120 quid with a height extension kit as well. online as well. Um, it's really, really good for you to set up. Uh, so, you don't have to spend too much money uh, to get the equipment. You can also see the bench behind me, that was about £100, 150 quid again online. Um, so, uh, you can have a really decent solid bench that I would spend a fortune on. Uh, so, next up then is uh, five sets of five of the bench press. Um, you might want to do a warm up set of five um, just to get used to the weight. It should be pretty warm by now anyway. Um, but uh, you want to work your way up to about 60k, 60 kilograms. I've got uh, two 36 kilogram um, uh, dumbbells, so I'm probably going to do about 26 kilograms a day. I'm, I haven't done uh, uh, 30s for a while, so I'm going to uh, drop the weight a bit. Working back up, uh, the aim is to get to five sets of five. Um, you can then uh, switch up the weight by about uh, two kilograms each dumbbell. So um, next up, the bench press. Uh, both the 26 kg is that quick, so you've got a total weight of 50 kilograms now. 
Five reps, you're gonna take one minute and 30 seconds rest, and then on with the second set. Say as well, it's important to stay hydrated uh, through your workout, but also um, make sure you drink a glass of milk before um, before working out. It gives you a bit of energy without having to feel something. And then afterwards, um, I have a 40 gram protein shake called For Goodness Shakes. You can get them in packs of uh, 12 on Amazon for about uh, 30 pounds. Very good value and easy to drink. And they're chocolate flavoured, very nice. So um, yeah, it's easy to get that food in you as quickly as possible afterwards by having a protein shake. And again, uh, it can be a bit pricey, but it can be very, very helpful, especially if you want to um, maximise those gains. Okay, that was the second set, just three more sets to go. Three, 
Uh, next set four, do another, do another minute and 20 seconds rest. Don't worry, on these last two sets, don't worry if you don't get to five. Um, it's not failure, it's just a goal we're setting. Um, the success is turning up and doing this workout. Um, so, don't worry about doing three or four reps. If you can't make to five in this fourth set or fifth set, just, just record the fact that you do three or four, try to beat that next time. Just trying to get better and improve, that's the aim. As you can see, I'm a real badass, and I did five. <laughs> uh, I'm really just messing. But if you, did, if you didn't do five, that's okay. Um, it's only fourth set. Just do that minute and 30. If you need a bit more rest, take three minutes, and do that final set of five, as many as you can do, and then you can give yourself a pat on the back. Okay, about another minute's rest. Go for that final five, okay. So these gloves are Fit4, I uh, got them on uh, eBay I think, Fit4, you can see that, I think I've got one, <laughs> got one on the wrong way around, never mind, uh, but it's called Fit4, and then uh, these other bands, um, they're called Iron Bull Fitness, very good, I got a bit of tennis elbow myself, and uh, these really really protect the arm, it's worth getting a pair, they're about £40 on the on uh, Amazon, so they're really really good, and as I say these Fit4 gloves were about uh, 20 quid on eBay. on the fifth one uh, and that was how not to put the weights on the floor don't ever do that um, but uh, I'll show you the correct te technique again um, how to put the weights down correctly Deadlift. 
and that's it. All you need to do now is a few um, uh, yoga poses to uh, cool down. Um, I'll show you a couple now. First one. Um, thing to do, don't overcomplicate your workouts, uh, the goblet squats, um, the clean and presses, the chin ups and the single arm bench presses combined with a 5x5 bench press, that's a pretty awesome workout for home. Um, the thing is, is to maybe decrease your uh, rest times in between, so I was going for 20 seconds rest in between each exercise, maybe a minute between the circuits. If you can get those rest times down even more, that'll get your fitness up. Uh, and, and obviously, with the bench presses, um, increase the weight. What you can do as well with the chin-ups, if you want to increase the weight, is get yourself a weight vest. I've got a 20, 20 kilogram uh, weight vest, but you can vary the weight from uh, anything from two up to 20. So um, 20 is a bit too much first. But the great thing about using a weight vest, you can do like one or two sets with a, with a chin-up with a, with a weight vest. Take the weight vest off, and you'll find your chin-ups so much more easier. Your body will be shocked, and um, it'll uh, be expecting a lot more weight, and the mind will think it's a lot easier. So, again, that's a good tip as well: is to, to start off doing maybe two or three really heavy chin-ups, take the, blend, the weight vest off, and then see how springy your chin-ups feel after taking the weight vest off. So that's another tip. Um, perhaps another video, I'll show you a couple of chin-ups with the weight vest on. But um, for now, for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this workout. Uh, it's pretty tough as you can see. I'm uh, pretty uh, feeling the beer, feeling the burn, and uh, pretty sweaty right now. So it's a pretty challenging workout. So I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I guess uh, it's designed for about five minutes warm up, ten minutes circuit, and maybe another five ten minutes of the heavy bench press. So if you give yourself half an hour, it's plenty of time to do this workout for. Um, so as I said, tips. Reduce those rest times and increase those weights gradually. Uh, but don't do any more than uh, your, your good form can take. It's always important to train your good form. All right, you take care, guys. See you soon. Bye.